Grizzlies hosting the Jazz, and the Grizzlies are four and a half point favorites. The over under is at 229 and a half. The Jazz are plus 152 on the money line, and the Grizzlies are minus 180. Now, these are the overnight odds. They're going to change the close so we get to tip off tomorrow. Now, thank you for everyone who has joined my Discord and who continues to join it if you've not done so yet. Please go to my website, rawsportstalk.com. Click on the membership tab. It is a paid membership, but it will give you access to my best bets and to my stats. The stats are usually in there a day or two before so you can see how these teams do against each other. Now, both of these teams are looking for a first, either the Jazz to get their first road victory or the Grizzlies to get their first home victory of the year. It's supposed to be George Clarkson, Abaji, Markinen, and Collins for the Jazz, and I apologize if I mispronounced somebody's name. And then we're supposed to have Smart, Bain, Williams, Jackson, and Biombo, and Williams is listed as questionable for the Grizzlies. Now, head to head, the Jazz are six and four against the Grizzlies in their last ten. The home team is on a seven-game winning streak. The home team is eight and two. The favorite is seven and three on the money line, while the underdog is five, four, and one against the spread. The over is eight and two, and the over two twenty-nine and a half is seven and three. Now, this is when the teams actually have a full squad, and you're not looking at the Grizzlies G League team. And I'm not trying to be super disrespectful, but this isn't what the Grizzlies normally look like. The over is 7-2 and two in the Jazz's games, and the under is 5-3 and three in the Grizzlies' games. The Jazz are on a four-game losing streak. They haven't covered any of those games. 228, 218, 243, and then 252 points have been totally scored in their last four, and the over is hit in their last two games against the Pacers and against the Bulls. For the Grizzlies, they are 1-3 in, in their last four. The game they won was the game that they covered. The under is hitting their last two, 242, 228, 212, and then 210 points. Both of these teams are bad. It's just which team is worse. I'm going to take the Jazz with the money line. I'm going to take the Jazz getting the points, and I'm going to go over in this one. I think that they'll be able to outscore the Grizzlies. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut, and please bet responsibly.